Okay, I'm back in Pokemon Y, and I uh, just made it to Shallower City. Um, Boolin's gonna evolve soon, so hopefully I can look forward to that. First though, I need to explore all of Shallower City, because I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of stuff that I can do. It helps when the game doesn't die. I don't know what's going on. And we have the Soothe Bell. That should help on, like, if I find any garbage friendship evolutions. But I already have all those friendship berries, so it's not really a big deal anyways. I'm probably actually not going to go back to the berry fields anymore. It's actually it's really far. So, um... Actually, wait. I'm pretty sure I go back to Lumio City. No, that's after Dendermill Town, so... Yeah, I'm not going to be going back to the berry fields for quite a while. Until I get fly. Joan should love me. Oh, it just gives me ribbons? Well, that's, uh, great. Okay, well, that's useless. On your second? Yes, I do. Oh, wow, she gave us Stardust for that? Like, it's free money. I mean, those TMs are pretty expensive. I still need to buy Rock Slide, actually. How much money do I have? Not how you check money. It's also not how you check money. What am I doing? Um, Rockside was 50,000 back in Lumio City. I have enough. Yeah, okay. I wasn't- I was never really a huge fan of the music here in Shell Lore, but it's definitely not bad music. It just, uh, it's relaxing, but it's not something I actively seek out, I guess. There's not really any musics in, uh, Pokemon games that I dislike. Like, there's there's nothing that would make me turn off sound. <laughs> and there are a few games musics that do that. Ah, crap, I didn't mean to talk to him. I forgot it was Mr. Bonding. Critical power, that means I'm not gonna use it. If it was prize money power, if you use me prize money power, then I could use that, but I'm not gonna use like O powers that affect the battle. These be TMs. Ooh, sweet. Whirlpool, that's useless. Sludge Wave is not useless. And neither is Iron Head. I think I need some potions. I'm just gonna buy a few. Need to make sure I'm stocked up for the gym, just in case. I keep going to the wrong thing. Okay, let's see. I already have two Soothe Bells. Wait, did they... Did they give me two? Or did I just find one randomly? Yes, oh my god, yes, 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 yes. Wait, it's one level away from learning Iron Head anyways. <laughs> oh man. Okay, well, I guess Gunk Shot's gonna go. Cool, Iron Head's good. Um, do I want it on Boo? I think Boo's attack is similar to its special attack. It does have a nice attack nature, but... No, I'll stick with what it has right now. What else did I do? Such wave rates. Ooh, you can learn that. I don't know what what the act like. What was I trying to say? I don't know what the uh, animation of Sludge Wave is trying to be because it looks terrible in this game. I'll probably show it off, but, uh, Sludge Wave in Gen 6 looks horrible. Pretty sure I went into this house already. No, I didn't. The Evil Light! Oh my god, yes! Yes, please! Thank you, thank you. I'm just gonna give that to Bullen. Bullen's the only one who can learn it right now. Learn it, use it. That's okay. It's still helpful. I 
can't actually go up there yet. Um, but I think I can go over here and get an encounter. Hopefully we get some sword and shield news fairly soon. Um, I really want to know more about that game. And if news has already come out, well, just remember that I made this in the past. Oh, I should go for a honey encounter. I'll use my last honey anyways. I'm not gonna buy any more, I'll just accept the rest. But for now, let's use this last honey. Get me something good. Gudra. Or I could get Love Disc, and now I'm gonna get Gudra. Uh, let me go ahead and just use Razor Leaf. This might be a bad idea. They should all die to this except Gudra. Perfect, actually. It's actually good, I can just go for another Razor Leaf. As long as I don't crit the Gudra, <laughs> I think it'll be fine. Gudra's one of my favorite pseudo legendaries, actually. I really like Gudra. I used it on my VGC team in uh, 2017 for Sun and Moon. I used it as a Tapu killer, which seems kind of strange because it's, you know weak to fairy, but, um, Assault Vest Gudra with, um, Max Special Attack is kinda gross, actually. Like, it, it could take up to four Tapu Koko Dazzling Gleams and not go down. And it, I, it had Sludge Bomb, so it would just Sludge Bomb once and Tapu Koko would go down. And that basically applied to every other Tapu. Lele was still the biggest problem, though. Anyways. That's enough reminiscing on my old team. I just have to figure out how I'm gonna kill this. Or not kill it, catch it. Uh, I guess I can go into Not Spy. I'll transform and do it. He's just gonna keep going for bind, but I don't think it's gonna do much to me, especially with um, not spines high HP. Okay, well I'm gonna speed this up. Um, I'll be right back. actually managed to catch a Gudra. Thanks, Nest Balls. I'm so happy about this. I mean, I already have, um... I already have Lucy, so... You know, I don't really need another dragon, but... Gudra's definitely a great thing to just have. Especially since it's a pseudo-legendary. I think that's all that's back there is a berry, if I'm remembering correctly. I might have to get something with cut just because I'm curious, but... There are Matang here! Well, it's not gonna be a Metagross, so it doesn't matter. But there are a lot of pseudos in the grass. Uh, he won't give me Lapras until I beat the gym, I'm pretty sure. Kinda sucks. Um, Lapras should be randomized, I hope. If it's not, then I'll just use it as a token as usual. Um, I'll just use it as a token on the same route. I mean, I could get a water encounter when I get Surf, so maybe I'll do that. Okay. Oh, okay. Thought my game died. Let me save, just in case that happens.
Halo. Okay, well, let's go check the Mega Evolution guy. I think there's a few more things to do. I, I mean, I'm pretty sure as soon as we go to the Mega Evolution temple thing, we just go to Karina's gym and that's the only place we can go. Citrus berries for a leper berry? Uh, no. I only have one citrus berry and I have a billion leper berries. I don't need to do that. Hello? Talk to him, please. I think that's everything in Shiloh City, so... Oh, I can get an encounter here! Let me go ahead and fish. I like how one of the answers when Tierno's talking to you is just a new dance. It's because this Tierno's character is so one-dimensional that, like, that's all he cares about. I like how you in the game acknowledges that. It's, it's boring. I really hate Tierno and Trevor. I don't mind Shauna, she's stupid, but I don't mind her as much as Tierno and Trevor, they're worse. Okay, hopefully I can find something good here too. Shiny Kadabra, I'll take it. And uh, I actually am gonna stop using shinies as bonus encounters now. I feel like since I, I know that I've um, upped the shiny rate, <laughs> it's a little uh, cheaty, so I won't do it anymore. But I'll just be, I'll just be happy when I get them. Okay, you know what? Um, that was shiny, so it counted as a bonus encounter, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get my real encounter now. That that's how <laughs> Okay, whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll stand by what I said. I'm angry now. I wish I- why did I have to say that right as that happened? I knew it was a Kadabra, it, it was gonna teleport away. Man, that sucks. I wouldn't have been able to evolve it for a while, but even then, you feel like Kadabra is actually pretty good. Kadabra special attack is like 105 or something high. So it definitely wouldn't have been bad to just have a Kadabra. I actually forgot to go check out Gudra. I'll do it before I head into the gym. But first, I have to battle Sharina. I think, or maybe that's after the gym. You know, I'm kind of hoping that the Mega Lucario isn't randomized, because I want Mega Lucario. Okay. Why does he even make it fuss about it? I don't remember what the Intriguing Stone does in this game. I know that in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, if you get the Intriguing Stone, you can trade it in for a Pidgeotite. But I don't think it actually does anything in this game. Alright, stop talking, please. Just... Let me battle Serena so I can get my Mega Stone.
Okay, okay, I know. Please. It's not as bad as Sun and Moon, but I really don't feel like talking to these people. Not that I don't mind, like, story and cutscene in these games, it's just I wish you could skip them. I, I like watching them the first time around, but, like, it can uh, get annoying when I'm replaying the game. Oh, she has a Charizard. A Mega Charizard? Why? Okay, well, I see what she's starting with. She really wants that Mega Evolution. And I guess that makes sense. Wow, okay. Let's not do with anything crazy here. Let me go into Lucy. I don't really have anything that's super effective on Charizard. The only thing I do have is Jones Bolt Strike. I think Lucy has Bolt Strike. Dude. It's a good thing it's not Drought, though. Wow, even without Drought, that did a lot of damage for something that was resisted. Charizard's only level 36, so it's only Flying Titan who should be Wing Attack right now. I guess my speed's back to normal. Well, I'm still faster than him. He has Lightning Rod! Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Mega Charizard Y with Lightning Rod? That's unbelievably good. Let me go for a cut. Please don't kill me. I'm, I just need him to go for Wing Attack and not Flame Burst. This Flame Burst actually hurts a lot. Especially now that it's... Oh god, okay. Is Wing Attack Scary Face Flame Burst? Um, I could transform into him. He won't have a dark type move. No, he doesn't get bite. But he's 10 levels above Not Spy. I don't want to switch into that. But Lucy does no damage to it. Dude, are you kidding me? Did this really have to happen? Let me just super potion and see how much damage a flame burst does if he goes for it. I need to actually calculate how much damage he's, he does. I'm at 102. Oh my god. 102 to 57, that's like <laughs> a lot. Let me switch. Let me check Spy's special attack actually. I mean special defense. So it has 59 defense and 73 special defense. Ugh. Yeah, no, it won't take it very well. Dude, this sucks. <laughs> he really had Lightning Rod. Ugh. I don't really have anything for this. I mean, it does resist. Yeah, okay, its last attack is Fire Fang, so his only two attacks are Fire or, uh, Fire Attack. So the only thing boosted by his Lightning Rod is Flame Burst. I can try going into Boo. I think that's one of my best bets here. And if Boo can't take it, then Boo dies and I don't lose Lucy. And then I'll just switch it to Spy and transform into it. I'm sure Spy can survive one hit, but he can't survive two. Oh wow, that did a lot. I mean, it was neutral, but... Yeah, I'm sorry, Boo. This Charizard is so strong. Okay, well, my only hope is to transform into it, then I have to heal. If Boo can survive a flame burst... Okay, that's fine. What is that? Okay, good. Well, I have a special attack boost now. He's probably just gonna spam wing attack now. Um, because I resist flame burst. But I think flame burst might still do more, because of Mega Charizard's disgusting special attack. Plus, I am special attack boosted. Why did I use Wing Attack? I said Flame Burst was stronger, and I went for Wing Attack anyways. Okay, Wing Attack did that much, and Flame Burst... 
Oh, he is switching it up. Okay, that's bad. I actually have to heal him just in case he uses Flame Burst. Okay, that did about the same. Well, she's gonna heal this turn. I don't die to the next attack, so let me just go for Flame Burst. Oh, she didn't heal. Thank God. Okay. What a pain. Crit me with Flare Fire. Should I just leave not spy in as this Mega Charizard? I think I should, unless something. Unless he sends out a rock type. Wow, I can't believe this thing has Lightning Rod. <laughs> the one's learning Double Edge. Actually, you know what? Let me learn Double Edge. I do have Rock Head. That's kind of funny. It's gonna lose Rock Head when it evolves, but that's okay. Okay, well first I'm gonna heal. Do I have anything stronger than a Soda Pump? I have a Hyper Potion, that's it. I was gonna go ahead and use one. Let's be safe and see what this throw has. Okay, he's gonna put the bulk up. That's bad. I was gonna go for Wing Attack, but I guess now it's time to just use Flame Burst. Quite a bit for something resisted. Oh, that's that good. Okay, I'm so glad Spy resisted, uh, survived that. I was scared of that after the revenge that Body Slam might kill, but looks like we're safe. Why well, she has its um, speed lowered? Why it was faster than me? Meta Gross. Okay, um, I really want to stay in, but. Do I have anything else? I have Morgana. Yeah, I think Morgana's my best bet. Let's just take out this Metagross. I need to find an opportunity to heal, not spy, and, um... Lucy. Yeah, my team definitely needs to improve quickly, because as soon as we hit, like, level 45, they're all gonna be fully evolved Pokemon like this. And if we keep encountering Mega Charizards, we're going to have a huge problem. Carablast. Meet your maker. I can use my newly acquired Iron Head for once. I'm surprised I did 5 damage. I thought it would be 2. I mean, Carablast's attack stat is actually pretty high. I'm pretty sure Carablast has like 80 attack. I guess after that Mega Charizard, <laughs> all she had left was her weak Pokemon. I mean, she had a Metagross too. She had Mega Charizard and a Metagross. I'm surprised she didn't have any healing items. I'm glad she didn't. She would have healed that Charizard. I need to move Iron Head to the top. Iron Head's the strongest move now. And Bulin's finally gonna evolve. I guess learning Double Edge was useless. Let me let me switch into Bulin just so I can use Double Edge once with Rockhead before it changes. That didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll just go for Muddy Water. I forgot Ninkata has a lot of defense, actually. I'm pretty sure uh, its special defense is like 20, while its defense is like 80. I'm actually kind of surprised I made it through that. That Charizard was really strong. But Boolin's finally gonna evolve. He's not going to be booling anymore, but he'll be something even greater, I hope.
We could evolve into something like a Caterpie and then not just evolve him again, but uh... Licky Licky. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I mean, Licky Licky's not a bad Pokemon, so I'm not angry, but... That's okay. I'll keep him. Good stuff, I know. Alright, well, I have to basically immediately go and fight Karina after this. And I also have to find something to replace Boo. You know, one thing that disappointed me about Mega Evolution in this game, actually, is that none of the trainers actually use it. The only trainer in the game, well, there's actually two, the only two trainers in the game who actually use Mega Evolution before the post-game are Lysander, the last time you fight him, and Diantha. It should have been more, um, prominent. Like, gym leaders in the end of the game should be using it. Maybe even the veteran ace trainers should be using it. It's just, like, it should have been more common. And the fact that you can only find them between 8 and 9 was a stupid decision. I don't know why they even thought of that. Just let me check out Boolin. He did level down, but he has battle armor, which is an okay nature. Um, it's... Which is an okay ability. Its nature is kinda bad, but... It's alright. I mean, double edge is a good move for it, so that's fine. Let me just see what TMs it can learn. Or, well, like, I guess I'll do that after I... Get my new Pokemon on the team. Kinda sucks that I lost Boo like I did, but I had to. Otherwise I wouldn't have been able to take out Charizard. Hasty with suction cups, that's not great. Um and that's it. Um oh yeah, I'm not gonna use that. Let me Sorry, right, Boo. You did have Iron Fist, but I guess that didn't really do anything for you. I could have taught it Bullet Punch. I completely forgot about that. Okay, who do I add? I did just lose my Grass type. Hmm. I guess I could add... Carnivine. Carnivine's not a bad Pokemon, so I guess I'll do that. That's fine. Hopefully I have some TMs I can learn. Cutter? Yes. I'll keep ingrain for now. Just cause um it could help me be tanky. Actually no, because I won't be able to switch out if I use that. It's not really safe. Can't learn leaf blade, which really sucks. I'll teach it cross chop though. Its special attack is similar to its attack, so um, it doesn't really matter what I teach it. Same with Licky Licky. I'm just gonna get rid of Razor Leaf. I guess it's time to get rid of Ingrain. Oh, I didn't even teach it Ingrain. I got rid of that. Let's give it a Fury Cutter. Okay, well that's not too bad. Alright, so I think I'm gonna end this one here. Uh, let me train Arnavine a bit. So yeah, I'm gonna end this one here. Um, I'll be back, I'm gonna take on Karina's gym, and I'll probably be able to fight Karina and get my Mega Evolution, 
the keystone next time so yeah we'll be back for that and uh thanks for watching